Let's hear from the manager, Kevin Cash, who is with Ken Rosenthal. Kevin, why did you pull Blake Snell? You know what? Just felt like at that point, Blake had given everything that he that, that we could have asked for out of him. Tough decision, gut wrenching decision. Nick Anderson's been arguably the best reliever in baseball the last two years. Wanted him to get through the inning. Totally understand the question, the criticism that's going to come with it, but confident that 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 we had two really good options to choose from. I understand this is the way you play. You guys had the best record in the American League, beat the Yankees, beat the Astros, got to game six of the World Series. But there were other factors here. Anderson had given up runs, six straight appearances. Blake had been really dominant against the top of their lineup. Mookie has been much better against righties than lefties. Did all that enter into it or no? Everything enters into the decisions that we're making. We want to do right, we want to make the best decision, or I want to make the best decision that helps our club win and Blake was outstanding for us um, you know looking back on it you really wish that Nick would have been able to get through it or we would have been able to get through it but I'm okay with the decision I think that's what makes us special is that we rely on each other we value information and knowing how talented the Dodgers lineup is to avoid any pitcher from seeing them th three times through makes a lot of sense when you look back at this series what was the difference well, the difference is they outplayed us. And to give a lot of congrats to the Dodgers organization, Andrew Friedman, Dave Roberts, his staff, and all their players. They're as talented as any team that I've probably ever seen, uh, as deep as thick. So they beat us. They showed that they were better, and they're celebrating. Kevin, thanks very much. Congrats on the season. Thanks, Ken. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's going to be tough, man. Like, I, I get it's a third time through the lineup, but... I mean, what I think I'm going to make the adjustments I need to make as I see them, you know, a third time. I think, I don't know, man, I just believe in me. I believe in my stuff. I believe in, you know, what I was doing. I didn't walk nobody. Um, they had two, you know, hits up the middle, and, you know, the slider to Barnes, you know, tip your cap, that was a bad pitch, um, and he got a hit off that. Good job. But for, for most of that game, man, I was – dominating every you know every every out, outcome possible so um and that lineup is so talented like so talented and yeah i don't know i'm just i'm proud in the way that you know i scouted them i scouted myself i'm just proud of everything i did to to put the team in a situation to win and and i wanted to keep going man i felt i felt so confident you know how i adjusted through seeing them a second time and what i was going to be able to do a third time like man i just I believed a lot in myself and what I did to, you know, hopefully see him a third time through and a fourth time if needed. I mean, I wanted to go that whole game. That was my, that was everything I wanted to do was just, you know, burn the tank and see how far I could go.